Hello everybody and welcome back to another World of Warcraft video where today we are actually going to finish Stockades. We are going to play through it and complete it, hopefully. Now, Tui is going to be primarily Healy for this because obviously she can take a lot of, or she can take some damage, but she really has to be keeping Dise up. But with some new mail on and some new abilities, let's try and uh, do this. So that, 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 let's swap and heal up Dise. Um. Oh, um. Oh, that was the only other guy. <laughs> Oh, that's right. I hit all of them. Okay, so basically how this ability works is that upon 20 Maelstrom, which is actually very easy to get, I just have to do one hit with my Boulder Fist, I do believe. Uh, yeah, because that generates 25 Maelstrom. Um, I can hit everybody with this that's in front of me. And then I can hit them with Boulder Fist again. Right? Does this... Yeah, to get a little bit more... Um, uh, Maelstrom. And then Lava Lash them. So, that's two hits. So, all basic NPCs should be... You. Oh, dear. That was not correct. Uh, heal. Start healing her. Start healing her. She's dead. No, she's dead. No, she's dead. Oh. Nope. Okay, I got some aggro. Let's hit them all. Hit them all. Hit them all. Hit them all. Now start healing DC again. <laughs> that was just a poor throw on my half. So, or poor pull on my half. That was almost a throw. <laughs> Let's just say that. Uh, she passes, but she needs because she's the gem. Tui is the gem craft. Gym crafter. Um. Oh, and have Tui pick up all of that lovely, lovely loot. Okay, I'm gonna pull them out to here. So, no, I want the elite. You, my good sir. And then hit them all. Hit them again. Hit them again, and start healing. And then Thunder Crash him again. That is a little bit easier. She's still taking a lot of damage. to e or uh, Dise is. But nothing unmanageable. Yet. <laughs> I guess three elites are going to do a massive amount. Um, But we'll see. No, this guy. Come here, please. Do that, do that, and heal her. And, oh, also it allows her storm strikes to hit everybody too. So if I can get up to that while it's still active, then she's just going to do a massive amount of damage to everyone. Which is kind of the hope, because she's kind of having to pull a lot of uh, damage off of uh, Tui. So... Let's get them all zapped. Nope. Tui. No. Stop healing yourself, Tui. Um, there we go. Okay, that was a little iffy. I'm i I'm still I am still getting used to uh swapping off with the healing and such, so. Um And I have to make sure that Tui is always targeting Dise. Um, okay, these two at the door, the th thug and thief. Um, yeah, let's just pull them in before we run out of Maelstrom. Start healing it up. Hit them both with that. Start healing again. 
Hit him again. Heal again. Uh, heal again. Hit you with Lava Tongue. I don't know why I haven't been doing that more. Um, and there we go. Very easy. Very easy two targets. I think that went actually very, very well. Um, actually, I think that went incredibly well. That was two elites and barely a sweat broken. So, let's try three elites. Now, we do want to look through them because there's one in particular that I do want to stun if... Yeah, here's the Troublemaker stun. So, I actually want him dead first. So, let's get that. No, two e. No, on D say on. Oh gosh, she actually did not do anything to create aggro. Ah, that's at all. So they, so she wasn't even part of the fight. Sorry, D say. <laughs> um, let's get D say back up. Um, yes, heal Dise. So that was me just not having Dise targeted when I started the heal, which was the problem is that Tui tried to heal herself and Dise really needed the heal. So, um, okay, let's drop that, do that, hit, hit. Like that. Start the heals. 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 Okay, that's fine. Tui can take... Tui can take a little bit of... Uh, damage. Okay, start healing DC again because he's back on her. Actually, start healing her again. Nope, back on me. So we see so we can do three elites now. Um Tui took a little bit too much damage, but that's because I didn't manage the um manage uh the aggro very well. So that is actually more my fault. Um let's heal up. Drop that for a second. And I do believe it's only the boss in... Oh, no. We have one other group. We have a troublemaker right there. So we're going to wait just for half a second for... Okay, maybe more than half a second. More like uh, 15 for Tui's heal to cool down. Target Dise. Or not heal, but healing totem. Drop that. D-Say fire. Uh, lure him or kite him a little bit. Start the heals. Um, heals. 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 Heal, uh, heals. Can't. Gotta keep that up. Gotta, gotta keep those heals up. Uh, and it's mainly just the swapping back and forth. Now, for any of those that are watching, I know that there's a multi-box or a multi-boxing uh, caster system. But I think that's just cheating because you're not actually controlling the characters. You're more like commanding the characters by doing that. And there's a difference. To tell someone to do something and to be on that person doing that thing are two very, very different effects. So the idea is, is that um, this is supposed to be a challenge. That's the whole point. To make something that's interesting for you guys to watch, it has to be somewhat of a challenge. And it's not a challenge if you're just commanding people to do stuff and you bind things to the same key so that everything goes off without a hitch. It's not 
it's not a uh, it's not very effective in terms of uh, Okay, start the heals, because he's bound to hit like a truck. Get the heals going again. Get the flame tongue. Get another heal off on her. Uh, he has a lot of health. My goodness. Um. But yeah, Dise or Tui back there is, is literally just healing. No, no, on me, on me, on me. Okay, you're gonna have to heal yourself for a second. Okay, heal Dise. Note to self, uh, make sure that they are at full health when uh, he does that. Oh, uh, heal. <laughs> I forgot to keep healing. Um. Heal yourself. Come on, focus. Focus me. Well, it's a good thing that she's wearing freaking mail. Otherwise, this would be just terribly difficult. Because <laughs> she would have died right there for sure. And that's kind of the idea too. What the? Mortimer Moloch. Oh, his brother, I'm guessing. The Wicked Dagger. Ooh, now that is an upgrade. Uh, Dise needs. Okay, so let's... Which one do I want to replace more? Uh, the three stamina would actually be a little bit nicer on her. So we want to... Uh, put it, replace the buzzer blade. Yes. Yeah, okay. Yep, that's the right one. Okay. Um. I don't know what that guy did in there. He just, like, I guess disappeared or something. Okay, Dewey, follow me. Um, actually, let's turn it in real quick, too, and see what we get. Because anything that can help us uh, along this path would help out immensely. Uh, just experience. Okay. Um, that's fine. Experience is okay. Uh, let's go down the knoll hall and kill all the knolls. Um, drop, zap. Oh, really? Really? You're gonna... You're ranged? Um... You're going to join into the fight, aren't you? Yep. Ow. Um, alright, let's... Well, let's beat this guy down then. That guy might join as well, yep. He ran up, though, so that's... A bit better. Um, yeah, we're just aggroing all of the uh, patrols. Don't mind us. Um, Tui's actually getting hit. Oh. Nope, Tui. You need to pull him off her immediately. And then sh so that Dise can start healing you rather than her. Um, and you, your little butt for being out there. Well, I guess this is the only thing I could do. Zap, zap, zap. <laughs> uh, pass, let Tui disenchant that. Um, so that was... Kind of stupid. One second. I'm healing up on Tui. Um, you, come here. 
Um, that he, since he wouldn't come, all of the patrols that... Um, oop, no, I want you... I really do want you attacking him. <laughs> all of the patrols, though, decided to uh, come over because of that. Let's pull you. Oops, no. Yeah, I want to stay on him. Let's heal up. Ow. And send, start sending another heal. Uh, let's not use any of our Maelstrom, as I do want to kind of save that for bigger pulls. Well, other than maybe that guy right there. <laughs> and we did regenerate most of the Maelstrom back up, so... Uh, let's head a little closer and pull the side rooms. You. Is it just you? Nope. So I do need to do that. Nope. You need to be targeting Dise. Um, I really need to ensure that she's targeting Dise all the time. Almost healed herself on accident. Yeah, so what? I'm rooted. What of it? Okay. Let's grab that. Let's actually pull the other room. Um. Oh no, I wanted to do that first. And then I don't have the... Range to do that. Okay, let's get some uh, of that back and not let her die. <laughs> that would be bad. Um, see, it's very easy to forget about the healing when trying to tank uh, with someone who's not meant to tank. Um, oh, really? You're one of these guys? Okay, well, I guess... You know what? You, join in. You do a lot more damage a lot quicker, so... There we go. Having two each just wreck him seemed to work a little bit better. Uh, we'll send D say a heal real... Oh, oops. A uh, heal real quick. Before we pull these next two rooms. Uh, yeah. You. Uh, hit him with that. Hit him with that. Targeting Dise. Very good. I don't know why you would ever not be targeting Dise. And let's just build Maelstrom for the most part. We have the mana to be able to burn for healing Dise. Um... But yeah, she does. Dise does a ton of damage. So. It's too far away. Um, start healing. Heal. And let's start building that uh, Maelstrom again for the next pull. Oh, really? You're gonna stop being a butt. Like, I know you gnolls like to be butts, but still. Um, you know what? We're gonna pull them into the side room here. Because that caster, I don't want that far away. So, let's loot. And then, hiya! You all can't see me. I'm gonna build up some threat, targeting... Make sure I'm targeting Dise. Um, keep up the heals. And then just build threat because our next pull is actually a three man pull. So, no making mistakes on the next one. <laughs> um, it's not really good for her, so pass. Disenchant. Let's head out here. Let's 
run DSA up. Uh, maybe to a little closer. Um, okay, drop that. Aggro. Okay, hit them all. Hit them all. Hit them all. Oh, wow, I killed that one guy really fast. If I combo these right, she does so much damage. Okay, just... Just build Maelstrom. Hey, stop. Stop charging 2E, please. Um. And I am actually swapping screens. I have a macro pad, which I have a key bound to Alt-Tab. So that's how I'm swapping between so fast. It's almost impossible to alt tab. So um, normally. So let's get this guy coming over. Targeting D say. Um, you. Uh, keep healing. <laughs> Let's not forget to do that. Um, okay, just generate Maelstrom for now. I need to generate some Maelstrom on you. And now for the infamous Hogger. In the old days, he used to be an elite that just wandered the... Uh, Wandered the wilds, so to say. Um, now he's a boss. He got upgraded. <laughs> um, I'm not sure if we should clear the sides first. You know what? That might be a thing. He might actually run into the other rooms once so hurt. So we're actually going to clear the side rooms real quick first. Have to e drop that. Come on. Oh, was it literally just you? Okay, well, I'll build Maelstrom while uh, I do that then. Uh, so that, yeah, that's an easy pull. <laughs> There's probably more in there. I'll, I'll double check in a second once this guy's dead. Um, it's not pull Hogger. Yep, there are a couple more guys in there. Let's pull him back. And this is a part of uh, um, the learning, is that you have to understand that it's a very real possibility that you can accidentally pull too much if you don't pull right. That being overcautious is better than being uh, reckless. So... Yep, come on. We want you. Oh, okay. Where's the door? We want to bring him back. Cause so that Tui can heal me. Uh Tui, heal. Okay. Um And that was just a pretty easy pull, so I don't I really don't want to spend a maelstrom on something as easy as this, so. Um let's loot. Now let's pull the next room. I'm not sure what I'm going to do about the room behind him. If he runs in there, we might wipe. So, okay, let's, we have multiple. So let's run over here. We have multiple, right? Why don't we have multiple? Huh, that's weird. They all can be pulled on their own. Um... That's really weird that they can all be pulled on their own. You know what? We're going to pull you because pulling you will actually... You'll run by the other guy and you'll pull him as well. Right? No, he just got pulled on his own. I wonder if that's a thing is that Hogger may get and... May grab them if you don't clear them, but only one at a time? 
Because he ran right by a fellow person. Um, we still don't want that to happen, so that's why we're going to clear as much of them as possible. But, um... But yeah, can you not? Okay, Tui, wreck his face. Man, that crit, holy. That was an impressive crit. I'm not sure if you guys can see the numbers on uh, Dise, but he just got wrecked. Okay, well. We can't pull the guys behind without pulling Hogger, and we don't want to pull any of them. So, uh, drop, pull Hogger. Make sure I'm targeting Dise because of that. <laughs> um, let's put Lava Lash down. Ooh, heal. <laughs> Me forgetting about healing is a very bad thing. Um, can you heal yourself and kill Hogger? That's the question. No, you can't. Oh, wait, that's right. She'll just heal herself. Uh, maybe she can kill Hogger on her own. No, I'm using too much mana. It's, yeah, no, I'm using too much mana. I would have to be autoing. And there's no way to auto with that much damage going on. What's this new ability I got? Chain lightning. Oh, well, that's nice. If I wasn't going to run out of mana... Can I, can I not auto? Oh, there we go. Oh, gosh. I know you guys can't really see what's going on, but it's an epic duel. And I'm about to run out of mana, though. So, um, so yeah. Hogger just does a crap ton of damage. Now, I have to be on point on the healing. Uh, does she have any mana potions? Not really. <laughs> Auto him for 80 or for 96. Um, but this is why I was able to take on elites even as a healer spec class all the time. Is that it's not actually that hard. And once you have enough. Okay, I'm just going to let her die at this point. I'm pretty much out of mana, right? Yep, I'm out of mana. Reincarnate. Apparently, that's a thing. Um, let's get Dise up. Okay, so I really have to be on top of, uh, healing. So, let's drop a totem, which will heal both of them. And then just go ahead and heal them both up anyways. Have her drink up her mana. Um, and we'll try that again. Um, I definitely did not do that very well. You could see that Tui could actually out heal Hogger. I just need to be swapping back to Tui, um, as much as possible. So, um, you're not drinking anymore. Drink, drink, my fellow, drink. Actually, what if I pulled Hogger into here? That wouldn't be a bad idea. Okay. Uh, Tui, drop a totem. Pull him. Make sure you're targeting Dise. Start healing. Because she's about to take massive amounts of damage. Keep healing. Basically, the issue here is, is will I have enough mana... To, uh, oh, gosh. Yeah, keep keep that healing up. Um, 
Uh, should I actually be using this healing, though? It's slower, but... Um... Nope, I got a quick heal. He did something that uh, hurt really bad. Um, ooh, nice heal crit. Um, oh yeah, we have plenty of mana. As long as I just keep doing damage to him. Um, oh gosh, why? I... I flubbed the healing again. Okay, that was my fault. Um, you know what? I need to... What I need to do is I need to rearrange my abilities. That way I'm clicking the same thing. Um, to... In which DC is clicking. Almost to that casting thing, but I have to actually swap to her to tell her to uh, do it. Um, which is a pretty close to the same, but not quite. Okay, heal up. Oh, that healing crit. Um, which is, I never knew was a thing. Okay. Let's try this again. <laughs> Round three. Ready? Fight! Um, we want to be causing much, much hurt. Oh gosh, he is hurting. Just focus on healing for a second. Um. He is hurting really bad. Come on. Keep the healing up. Okay, Tui is actually running out of mana this time. Um. Oh, he had rages. Okay. So Hogger might be a little too difficult. Um, they just don't have the armor or the defensive capabilities um, to defeat Hogger. Um, okay then, let's try the elemental side then. At least we know our limits. Um, we can't stop him from enraging, that is definitely a thing. But at the same time, we can't do enough damage either. And two, he certainly can't heal enough to, uh, to, um, ensure that they don't die. So, um, uh, let's actually, oh, really? Okay, and I messed up that, so... Um. You stop it. And wrecking the regular ads. Getting wrecked by the bosses, but wrecking the regular ads. Hmm. Uh, let's have them both run down. I need a Drop a healing totem. You, come on. 
There's probably a big one in there as well. Nope. Just pulled you. Oh, there is a stone one, but he's kind of behind a wall. So he didn't see me. Essentially. <clears throat> Gosh, I'm having to retrain my hands now that I moved my heels around a little bit. Yeah, that was just one. For a second there, I thought it was two. Um... Uh, let's build up some Maelstrom. Put a heal on Tui real quick. Get the next guy out. And again, just by himself, which is a little confusing. Um. Huh. Yeah, because there's this little fire guy right here. Um. But yeah, pretty simple. We'll probably just wreck through these guys really quick. And get this little guy de dead. Gotcha. You almost got away. Not quite. Um, let's loot up all of that. And we will pull him. The other guy's a mage, so I'm not too worried about it. You heal. Uh, he doesn't do a ton of damage, so. Um, stop. I uh, heal her up. And hi -ah. Um, let's look in here. I kind of want them all at once. I need to get closer. And of course, it doesn't. Okay. These pulls are going really slow, and it's making me want to use Maelstrom where I don't need it. Uh, let's just apply everything we can. Uh, you, come on. Oops. I did not mean to swap like that. Um, yeah, let's just try to build some Maelstrom. This part's boring. Just a little bit. Because we've proven that we can uh, get through all this pretty easily now. Or all the ads, at least. Um. And we do want to clear them out, just so that, uh... Just so that we don't accidentally pull them. Should... Something happen. Something go awry. Um. There we go. We'll loot all that up. Now we get on to the difficult stuff. Three elementals at once. Okay. Actually, bring Tui up a little closer. Um. Ooh. Oh, you're part of the three. Okay. So, yeah, I kind of want to be hidden from you. I, and I kind of want to be a little closer, so... Let's go right here, drop that. Okay, hit them all, hit them all. Man, th that lightning thing can wreck them so fast. And if I need to keep focusing on healing. <laughs> um. Let's generate a little bit of Maelstrom. Because I'm, I'm not sure what I'm facing next. If it's going to be the boss or if I need to pull the side rooms. Um, probably should pull the side rooms. There are a couple adds in them. Not too many. But there's there are a couple. Which we should defeat first. Just to be a little bit of an irritant. I interrupt him. <laughs> Um, 
Let's heal up Dice a little bit more and pull the other guy. Um, over here. That little elemental didn't uh, aggro either, which is a little confusing. But, okay. Uh, let's heal up Dice a little. Oh, he did pull. Um, now I want you to wreck him. Uh, to he's fighting. Uh, the little elemental. Ooh, hello. Uh... Disenchant that because um, they have their heirloom cloaks. So they're not needed. Let's get the big guy. See if it pulls both. I want both. Yay, I got both. Nope. Target D say. <laughs> oh my gosh. I thought we were over this problem. And keep healing her. Um, that was fun, though. Uh, I just have to remember to keep healing. That's pretty much the main thing, is that if I... The moment I forget to heal is the moment I die. <laughs> so. Come on, you. New. Um throw that on. We have plenty of mana at the moment, so I'm not too worried about um, overhealing at the moment. Uh, pass. Need, as she is the jewel crafter. Pick all that up. We're going to pull the boss into here. I do think that he might have a pretty massive AoE, so I'm backing Tui off quite a bit. So... Okay, do we drop a heal totem? And let's try this. No. He is immune to... Um, interrupts. Nope. Target d please. As I suspected, he does have AoEs. Um, let's just keep wrecking his face, though. Uh, he does a lot less damage than Hogger. This is for sure. Then again, Hogger is supposed to be that character that's just super hard to beat, too. So, you know what? I'm going to try doing one of those with that, because I seem to wreck them all the time with that. I'm not sure if that actually did anything, tell the truth. Tui is getting hurt a little bit. Let's drop a healing totem for her. Uh, keep that healing up. Um, but yeah, this guy is much easier. Much easier. Uh, he just does a lot of AoEs, which are easily countered by any, uh, AoE-esque heal. So. Do that, do that, do that, do that. So. Little bit easier. But. No, actually, a lot easier. He's just, like, a large add at the moment. Lord Overheats. Two, he can do the honors. Plate, which neither of them need. So, disenchanted. But, that is two of the three quests down here. Oh, I needed his core, huh? So, you got his core? I do believe so. Because he is not glowing for you. Okay. Alright, let's get going. That'll be about it for the episode. Hogger being just a little too much damage for poor old Dice to be able to handle. Um, and a little bit too much damage for Tui to heal. But, essentially, we almost got Stockade done. I'm not going to say we did, because we didn't. That would be weird if I said we got it done. Hogger's still alive. Um, but... Oh, and she leveled. Safe travels. Um, chain lightning. I gotta figure out what I want to do with that chain lightning. Maybe right there. Um, 
and DC did not get any abilities. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Please do leave a like if you did as it helps the channel and do subscribe if you're not already to catch the next episode as it comes out. We're going to be doing a different dungeon next. I'm not sure which one yet. But if you want to support the channel, there is a link to a Patreon in the description below. Ooh, maybe No More Gone. Ooh. Or Scarlet Halls. Scarlet Halls would have some stuff. No, Scarlet Halls would have a lot of plate, so I don't think so. Maybe No More Gone. Um, as well, in the description, there is a Twitch and Twitter to uh, catch me when I live stream. Anyways, if you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, please leave those in the comment section below, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching, and have a good one. Goodbye.